He's only known for One Piece, and this One Piece is only known because of its inclusion in video games. I'm the Classical Nerd, and today we're talking about Hermann Necker. I'm going to be totally upfront here. There's absolutely no available research on this guy, except for this. He was a German composer who was born in 1850, died in 1912. He played the trombone, as can be seen in this wonderfully grainy picture. And he wrote a piece called Zikos Posht, which is Hungarian and refers to a guy who rides on top of a couple of different horses at the same time as, like, a trick. And this is only known because it was included in various video games in, I would imagine, 8-bit form, beginning with, as far as I can tell, Yoshi's Cookie in 1992. He's so obscure that there's nothing in the way of biography available online, no matter how enthusiastically one digs. I mean, my normal approach is useless here. But I will not be stumped without a fight. There is, after all, the music library. Actually, they ban filming inside, so we're just gonna have to settle for this shot, but believe me, I used their resources, and I searched for this guy. And what I found might shock you. It was nothing. Like, it was actually, literally, nothing. Not even any false positives, just a big old no results found. There is nothing we, to speak as the collected intelligence of humanity, know about this dude. You know, throughout the history of this channel, I've prided myself on putting together succinct biographic information from various sources on many an obscure name from music history. But this guy absolutely has to take the cake. There's no other way about it. Like, it actually surprised me that there's nothing. Like, usually there's at least some tidbit, some story, or he appears as a minor character in somebody else's biography. For this guy, there's absolutely nothing. I will certainly keep my eyes peeled, because you never know, and if I do find some information, I'll definitely post it in the comment section below. But, I mean, let's just put it this way, I'm not holding my breath for a revival of this guy's music. 